Hello, it's Monday, April 6th. I'm Keenan Smith. There are now nearly 16,000 confirmed cases of the coronavirus here in Michigan. 617 people have died, and the White House is warning that cases could peak here in Metro Detroit and in other hotspots around the country as early as this week. Well, big companies here in Metro Detroit are ramping up production in the fight against the coronavirus in Michigan and nationwide. General Motors is starting production of masks this week at its transmission plant in Warren. The automaker eventually plans to produce 50,000 masks a day. Jim is also in the process of making ventilators at his plant in Kokomo, Indiana. And Ford is also a part of the growing fight. In just over a week's time, the automaker has shipped one million face shields across the country. More than 190,000 of those face shields have been sent to healthcare workers and first responders in New York and New Jersey. And Ford says it remains committed to doing whatever it can to protect healthcare workers on the front lines. And the spirit of Detroit is sending a pretty obvious and serious message. The statue in downtown Detroit is now sporting a mask. The spirit of Detroit typically shows its pride in wearing the sports teams of Metro Detroit. But now, of course, it's all about safety and the coronavirus. Well, after a sunny morning, more clouds roll in this afternoon. Dry weather, though, at least during the daylight hours. We get the chance of some showers after 9 p.m., continuing overnight through 10 a.m. tomorrow. Dry tomorrow afternoon, more rain tomorrow night. Dry Wednesday afternoon, more rain Wednesday night. It'll be getting much colder by Thursday, lasting through the weekend.